Canada's premier dog sled adventure company comes from humble beginnings. I was 19 years old and um, I met my first dog sledder. He gave us all a ride and introduced us to the dogs and I'll never forget my first ride and I was hooked. That was it. I went for that ride and my whole life went to the dogs. After her initial dog sled experience, Connie decided to harness her dreams and start a family business. My late husband and I started with three dogs. Uh, he had a couple dogs and I had uh, one and then um, we just started growing. Everything was multiplying and uh, at one point we had the 10 dogs. That's when we first started our official programs and now we have over 170 Huskies. So this is almost 30 years later. What's most unique about our outfit is that we teach all of our guests how to drive their own dog teams. So we give everyone an instruction at the beginning of their program and uh, introduction to the history of our sport and they at the end of this instruction get to decide you know maybe this is a bit much for me I want to go on a guided sled but for most of our guests the most exciting experience is to drive your own dog team and there's nothing else like it. 30 years and many memorable experiences later the torch is being passed on to the next generation. When my husband and I developed the company, um, we wanted to do something that we could include them. Um, they've been coming out since they were about six months old, both of them. And at four years old, they were taught to drive their own sled dog team. It's just something we were born into. It's something we've always practiced. And so the only, the only pressure is living up to uh, the standard. And, uh, oh, you know, but we're, we're always practicing to get better. Born and raised with the dogs and loving every minute of it. So for me, it's my lifestyle, it's my passion, and it is the thing I love to do most in the world is teach people about our brilliant dogs and just work with the dogs in general out outdoors. My mom and dad worked so hard to get this to where it is today. And I'm very proud of what they did. You know, it's unbelievable. Um, you know, and, and mom, even now, she's, you know, my sister and I look after, we try to look after almost everything and she still just works super hard and, you know, she doesn't really have to, but it's hard, right, for her not, she's always worked that way. I am taking on something that my parents have created and passed on to me, which is a huge honour, but it's also a chance for me to put a new twist on it. You know, we're a younger generation and coming into it with a different view doesn't mean that we're not you know upholding the standards my mom implemented with my dad we're certainly holding on to those but we're bringing something new it's important for sure that we keep that same work ethic and we're proud of what we've done the sport teaches you so much about yourself you, it shows you your strengths and weaknesses very gracefully the dogs will point them out just the experience itself is so unique I mean, I always tell people if it's not the coolest thing you do in your lifetime, it's going to be a top three for sure. I have learned more about people and life working with the Huskies in a natural wilderness environment than any other job I've ever had.